So people in this video let us look at the errors of refraction okay we want to look at the refractive errors right of the eye okay so first of all understand m metropia okay so basically optically normal eye so m metropia is uh, defined as the state of refraction wherein the parallel rays of light coming in from infinity are focused at the sensitive layer of retina with the accommodation being at rest so the best way to understand this is first of all understand m metropia is normal vision okay so the person can see clearly so basically <clears throat> explaining this parallel rays of light right coming in from infinity are focused at the sensitive layer of retina with the accommodation of the lens being at rest right with the accommodation being at rest so this is normal vision so now let us move on to the refractive errors errors of refraction here what in all you will see this is called as ametropia okay ametropia is something wrong with the vision right so what and all can be wrong there can be <clears throat> myopia hypermetropia myopia means what short sightedness short sightedness right hypermetropia astigmatism and isometropia and i and iso iconia fine so these are the errors of refraction so first understand what myopia is short sightedness so myopia is what short sightedness so this is what i have so you have to wear a specs to see far right so short sightedness means whatever is near you can see but whatever is far can't see okay so here what happens the parallel beam which is coming it is focusing in front of the retina right this focusing in the front of the retina when accommodation is at rest always you are writing this when accommodation is at rest so what is myopia this is short sightedness okay there are a lot of types of uh, myopia all that we will look at in myopia video okay so correction with lens usually they give a concave lens for this minus power right negative power minus minus 2 so i wear a concave lens to look far so this is correction with lens okay so now we have we have uh, looked at myopia now let us look at what hypermetropia hypermetropia is what or it is also called as hyperopia okay long sightedness what is it hyperopia or it is long sightedness okay it's not at all cooperating long sightedness the image is being formed behind the retina right when the accommodation being at rest right so this is long sightedness this will get corrected with a convex lens so convex lens will have positive power okay so there are a lot of types of hyperopia or hypermetropia we are not going into the details now let us move on to the next ametropia that is astigmatism okay so astigmatism is also a refractive error right the refraction varies in different meridia of the eye just look at this first let us look at the vision okay so what you are seeing here this is normal okay and what you are seeing on the other side this is astigmatism so don't think that this is normal if you have this kind of vision it could be astigmatism okay so now let us look at how the image is formed so here you can see normal eye parallel rays focusing here and 
astigmatic eye is doing something and all. So it is having different meridia of the eye. Astigmatism is a type of refractive error wherein the refraction varies in different meridia of the eye. The refraction itself varies in different meridia of the eye. Consequently, what happens? The rays of light entering the eye cannot converge to a point focus but forms focal lines. So, there is not a single focus here, right? Focal lines are there. So, you have in astigmatism, so this is the vision of the person, right? Kind of blurred vision. So, basically, you have regular astigmatism and irregular astigmatism. We will come to the details in the astigmatism video. So, people, main three are over, right? Myopia, hypermetropia and astigmatism. Now, let us look at anisometropia. What is this? Basically, isometropia means there is equal refraction of uh, in both the eyes. Okay, that is isometropia. Whether uh, it is more or less, leave that. But both the eyes are working similarly. That is isometropia. And isometropia is where each eye is working differently. Look at this one. Look at this. Beyond the retina, on the retina, before the retina, on the retina, right? So, there are some combinations here. A lot of details, if you want, you'll have to watch the anisometropia video. So, basically, when the total refraction of the two eyes is unequal, the condition is called as anisometropia. Some small degree of anisometropia is not a concern. If it becomes greater than 4 diopter, then it is not tolerated and it becomes a matter of concern. Lastly, let, let us move on to an, an eyes iconia. Okay. So, basically here what they are saying is there are two retina, right? One eye here and one eye here and two retina. And the two retina are sending information where? To the visual cortex, right? Now, basically the retina, okay, the two retina are sending image with unequal size or shape. Okay, so this retina if it sends something like this and this is sending like this. So, size is also different, shape is also different. So, unequal size and or shape. So, the size is different or the shape is different or both are different. This becomes an eyes iconia. Okay, up to 5% of difference is tolerated. Beyond that, it's not tolerated. So, that is an eyes iconia. So, what was that? An eyes iconia. Okay, so that is where you are talking about size and shape of the images formed by the two retina. Retini, okay. So, we have completed in this video refractive errors, right. We looked at the term M metropia where everything is normal. Then we saw A metropia where we saw myopia which is short sightedness hypermetropia, astigmatism and isometropia and eyes iconia. So, myopia we saw it is nearsightedness. So, myopia is corrected with concave lens, negative power. Hyperopia, long sightedness, corrected with convex lens, positive. Astigmatism, where there is no focal point, right? There is a focal line they are seeing. This is corrected with cylindrical lens, okay. Then we saw an isometropia, okay. And lastly, we saw an eyes iconia. Here, an isoconic glasses they will give, okay. There are a lot of other ways of correcting. Basically, I have understood where concave lens, where convex convex lens, where you are giving cylindrical lens, where you are giving an eyes iconic glasses, all that, right? So, that's all for now in um, refractive errors or ametropia, okay? Bye-bye.